Hello everyone, this is Simran Verma from Informatica. In this video, I'll brief you about Purge Data feature in MDM SAS. Purge Data in Multi-Domain MDM SAS. We will divide our discussion into three categories. Firstly, overview, then configurations, followed by the demo. Previously, customer did not have provision to perform Purge Data. It was only done via Informatica operations team. Then, this provision was only given to the lower environments and now we can do it from all environments. This feature has come in April release 2023. Doing purge data will delete data from all your assets within the org permanently without having any impact on data model. Under purge data in global settings, we get options as purge all data, or purge historical data only from the data store. We also have an option to perform purge data from for a specific business entity, but this option is toggle based and can only be enabled after PM's approval. Coming to the roles, user needs to have admin role assigned to perform data purge activity. A brief description of steps as Log in to IICS B360 console, traverse to global settings and then go to purge data. Click on start, it will show you the three options which I have mentioned under configuration. Click on next, it will ask you for your organization ID, provide the same and then click on submit. The same you can monitor it from the my jobs page as well. Purge data will be done in three steps. First. It will delete the data, then all the validations created on those data, and then the smart search indices on those records. Let me show you a demo for your better understanding. So, I have my B360 console already launched. We need to go to global settings, then purge data, and then start. Before I start, as I have mentioned, it will ask you for an organization ID, which I will copy it from here. I click on start and then as I have mentioned we can see three options purge all purge the history data of all records purge record that belong to a specific business entity the only difference here is the, the purge data for business entity will ask you for a business entity name whereas the logic goes same for all the three options I'll show you in a demo how to do it how we do it for a specific business entity so I'll select one of the business entity which I have created for my replications. Let me select the test PE then click on select. It will give you this warning message but we are good to go. We'll click on next. As it has asked for organization ID, we'll paste it over here. Then we'll click on purge. The job has started successfully. Now we'll go to my jobs. And from here, we can monitor the job. I have this already done in my in one of the business entity. I'll show you that as a de uh, for your demonstration. Here you can see we have a job instance ID for a complete job, and for specific steps, we also have different job instance IDs. And we can also have runtime parameter and metrics for other further details. Make sure to provide only the relevant role to the user who is supposed to perform the data purge. And in case if you face any issue or concern or if it is a getting error out, please reach out to Informatica Global Customer Support. And during this job, it is not recommended to perform any other job, but only this job. Also, before I conclude, we have a one note point to mention is it will purge only 1 million data in one go. Say suppose you have 2 million data in your complete org, then you have to perform purge all twice. And same logic applies to the purging data from specific business entity as well. So that's what the demo is. 
थैंक यू सो मच